So Among Us is one of the biggest games in the world with millions of players. And in the world of Among Us, there are many big things such as Polis, one of the biggest planets in the game. And there is a telescope that lets you see many planets and strange objects in space. And have you ever wondered, what do these new planets have? Us crewmates are always curious about the unknown and want to know the answer to everything. And I'm sure this question has crossed your mind at least once. Why is part of Polis missing? And well, I have the answer to that question. And I'm here to tell you everything. And before we get any further into this video, if you enjoy my content and want to see more, let's try to hit our like goal of 25,000 likes. That way I know you want to see more of these type of videos. And if you want to be part of the Chari family, make sure that you hit that subscribe button with the bell icon turned on. That way you won't miss out on any of my new videos. But now let's begin with today's story video. So in Among Us, we only really know about four different planets. Number one being Earth, which is the home of the crewmates and bases such as Mira HQ and the airship. Then we have the map of Polis, which is an entirely different planet. And this planet is known as Polis. They just named it the Polis map. I personally believe they should have named it something else, but whatever. Then we have two different planets that we don't have a name for. We have this turquoise planet, and as I said, there is no name for it. And the last and final planet is probably the most interesting one, which is this purple and orange planet, which looks very similar to Polis. And I'll explain later on, because I have a theory on why this planet looks similar to Polis. And now let's take a look at the rest of the things that we can see in space. And I'm getting all this information from the telescope which can be found on Polis. We can also see a spaceship, which a lot of people say that's a scaled, and I can see it, but I'm not entirely sure. It could be the spaceship that drops off the dropship. Then we have this sort of asteroid slash moon. To me it looks more like an asteroid. Then we have a distant galaxy, which is most likely Andromeda, which is a Milky Way's nearest galaxy. And fun fact, scientists believe that the Milky Way and Andromeda will collide in 6 billion years. And the name of this galaxy will be Milkdromeda. Then we have this distant star, which is surrounded by a Dyson Sphere. And if you don't know what that is, it's basically a way of harnessing the energy from the sun. Which is why it's surrounded. And that actually made me realize how advanced the crewmates really are. They can harness the energy from the sun? That's crazy. And lastly, we have this blue thing. I'm not entirely sure what that is, but it looks somewhat similar to space dust. So I'm just gonna say it's space dust. So now you're most likely wondering why do I need to know all this information? And it all has to do with him. It's Riot. One of the biggest imposters in all of Among Us. And he's the one that took a bite of Polis. And has been an enemy of the crewmates ever since. So how is one of the biggest imposters in Among Us enemies with the crewmates? Well it all has to do with this planet. Which is a sister planet to Polis. This planet is known to be very hot, with fires burning for years, and Polis is the complete opposite. It's a much colder planet, because you can see snow just about everywhere. So it turns out that there was actually life on this planet, and Polis wasn't the only one. This planet was more dangerous. Because as I mentioned earlier, there was fires just about everywhere. So in order for a creature to live in these harsh conditions, they have to be strong. And Riot was one strong creature that somehow managed to survive in these harsh conditions, which is incredible. So Riot was a small creature at the time. He would drag his body across the planet looking for food and also shelter since the conditions were horrible. Eventually one day Dark found this planet 
and Dark was having a conflict with the crewmates. Neither side wanted to give up. Even though the crewmates were small, they were strong in numbers. So Dark took Riot into space because he saw that Riot has been on this planet for so long and he knew that Riot was a chosen one. Since he managed to survive in harsh conditions, Dark knew that Riot would be powerful, and power is what Dark needed in order for him to demoralize the crewmates and take them down. So Dark used one of his abilities, which made Riot grow in size. Riot became so big that you could see him from Polis. He was massive. Dark now had control of one of the most powerful imposters to ever live. Dark ordered Riot to go to Polis. And Riot was a little hungry. So he took a bite of Polis. Which was horrible for the crewmates. A huge chunk of the planet was now missing, and the entire planet was now filled with lava. Which is why you can see the lava pool. There's lava just about everywhere. I'm honestly surprised that Polis managed to survive. Riot could have ate the entire planet, but Dark wanted the crewmates to pay the price. And he was gonna do everything in his power to make life miserable for every single crewmate. And that is why part of Polis is missing. Polis used to be a planet that was covered with snow. But ever since that day, the temperature increased due to the lava pouring out which caused most of the planet to lose its snow. Which is why you can only see snow at the North Pole. Riot was now feared by every single crewmate. They've never seen an imposter so massive. How could they possibly defeat him? He's just as big as Polis. And that's one problem that the crewmates have to face till this day. Who knows when Riot will return. But when he does, we need to be ready. And if you want to summon Riot, you want to click on Vitals 5 times. That way you can send a radio signal to space. Then you want to touch the weather node 5 times. And lastly, you want to make your way over to the telescope. Make sure that you follow every single step. Open the telescope several times until Riot appears. And you will see Riot crash into another planet. And that's the story of Riot, one of the most powerful imposters to ever live. If you did enjoy this video and want to see more, make sure to drop a like down below. I do also want to give a massive shout out to Kitty King for helping me produce this video. If you want to support a smaller creator, make sure to go check out his channel and subscribe to him. And if you're new to the channel and want to see more story videos, make sure that you hit that subscribe button with the bell icon turned on. And check out these other Among Us story videos that are found on my channel.